morning decides let us go on a virtual tour to some worth visiting places in india through this virtual journey do you know students india is a beautiful country offering diverse destinations for tourists it has a wide variety of terrains from majestic himalayas in the north to indian ocean in the south the golden desert in the west to the breathtaking beauty of the seven sisters in the east there are many different sites worth visiting in our country more than 20 different official languages multiple religions and a variety of cuisines exist within the indian borders to truly experience the richness of indian culture and history travel is the key children do you know when is national tourism day celebrated in india and why is this day observed in india 25th january is marked as national tourism day the government of india created this national tourism day to promote awareness about the richness of tourism in india india is a land with different types of tourism that adds to its economy in a myriad way The tagline of Indian tourism is Atithi Devo Bhava. This is a Sanskrit term that means guest is like god. This Atithi Devo Bhava campaign was launched in 2005 with Bollywood actor Amir Khan as its ambassador. So students without much ado Let us go on a journey through this majestic India. Here is a look at a few best places to visit in India. Dear students, the first place that we are going to explore is Spiti Valley in Himachal Pradesh, North India. Spiti is a cold desert mountain valley located high in the Himalayas in the northeastern part of India in Himachal Pradesh. The name Spiti means the middle land that is the land between Tibet and India. Spiti Valley is famous for its natural beauty and cultural heritage. Tabu Monastery is one of the most prominent attractions in Spiti. The monasteries in Spiti are renowned for spectacular murals, ancient temples and several stupas. The best time to gaze into the magical beauty of Spiti is from March to June when the temperature ranges between 0 to 15 degrees Celsius. Generally, the minimum temperature in Spiti is below 2 degrees Celsius and the maximum temperature is between 14 to 18 degrees Celsius. The distance of Spiti Valley is about 1508 kilometers from Bhopal. One can reach Spiti from Bhopal by using all the three modes that is by air, by road or by train. You can experience a lot of good activities here in Spiti like river rafting. It is a true call for adventure. One can pay a visit to Buddhist monasteries. Lake view campaigning is another good activity in Spiti. If you want to have a unique experience, go for a yak safari and many more. The second place which we are going to visit virtually is Kundal Beach in Gokarna, South India. 
with its pristine beaches and breathtaking landscapes Gokarna is a Hindu pilgrimage town in Karnataka and a newly found hub for beach lovers Situated on the coast of Karwar every year Gokarna welcomes hordes of tourists from around the world in search of sanctity and relaxation the out of town beaches like kundal beach and om beach are a different contrast of life inside the town palm clad beaches are dotted with foreign tourists in a majority and very few indians are seen across the beaches are meant for a slow relaxed holiday and everything on the beach goes at the same relaxed pace full of coconut and palm trees the ocean and the clean sand gokarna is a one of a kind place in the country the best time to visit gokarna is from october till march when the weather is warm and pleasant The aerial distance of Kundal Beach Gokarna is about 1378 kilometers from Bhopal. One can reach Kundal Beach by all the three modes that is by air, by road or by train. You can experience a lot of good activities in Gokarna like you can visit and relax on various beaches like om beach nirvana beach and of course gokarna beach parasailing banana boat ride and jet skiing are some other attractions of this place the place 3 which we are going to visit virtually is malanong village in the state of meghalaya to the east of india this village is located in the east khasi hills district of the meghalaya state in northeast india it is notable for its cleanliness and also known as asia's cleanest village the village comes under the peninsula community development block and vidhan sabha constituency The aerial distance of Malanong village is about 2017 kilometers. You can reach this place by air, by road and by train. The best time to visit this place is summer season. That is during June to September. During this season of the year, the flowers bloom and the environment becomes quite lively the best places to visit here are jing baham living route bridge malanong waterfall brun kongem view point balancing rock masmai cave and noni thiang falls the fourth and the last place which we are going to explore virtually is Bharatpur in the state of Rajasthan to the west of India Bharatpur is also one of the world's best known bird watching destinations Kyoladev Kana National Park 250 years ago the ruler built embankments that allowed flooding of this land turning it into a marsh named after the dense jungle that surrounded an old shiv temple this 29 square kilometer man-made wetland is known for migratory birds ducks waders raptors 
fly catchers and more. In winter, avid birders and ornithologists flock to the park to observe and study the feathered beauties. With more than 370 recorded species, this national park also hosts the Siberian crane. It is a World Heritage Site. The aerial distance of Bharatpur is about 451 kilometers from Bhopal. You can reach this place by air, by train and by bus. Bharatpur district has an amazing view and climate in monsoon and winters. Bird watching of beautiful migratory birds can be seen in the Kyoladev National Park during winters. The most popular places to visit in Bharatpur with kids are Kyoladev National Park, Deek Palace, Government Museum, Baki Bihari Temple and Kyoladev Shiv Temple. Wow! What a splendid virtual tour we have just witnessed students. I hope you all have enjoyed every bit of it. In just a few minutes, we have toured beautiful, not much explored places of India. Our country is rich in diversities of all sorts, physical, geographical, cultural, linguistically, biodiversity and many more. Probably no other country in the world has these many diversities lying warmly under one umbrella. That is the unique charm and greatness of India and we have just seen some glimpses of it. Yes children, I know, unfortunately it's not the right time to visit these places but let's pray that we all visit these places physically also very soon. Thank you.